Hello, Yawning Angel here again with another Amos video, although this one is slightly different. That being that I'm not actually doing any coding in this video, no. This video is purely an announcement video to let you know that all the source code that I've been creating for these tutorial videos is, as of today, as of the date of this video, now available for download from my website. So that's good news. This means that you can get hold of that source code and use it in your own programs or pull it apart and rejig it and do all the wonderful things you want to do with it for free. So what I'm going to do is show you how to get there and how to download the code. And let's do that right now. Okay, so what you need to do, open up your browser and head yourself over to yaretro.co.uk and this will take you to my website. And things on my website include stuff about my Amiga, my BBC Master and my ZX Spectrum, obviously link to videos, my YouTube channel, a bit about me, how to contact me and most importantly of all for this, a downloads link. So if we hit download, this takes you into my Amos tutorial video download section. And here you will find for each video that I have done, there is a, or there are, sorry, a number of files. So uh, let's take a look at the structure under here. Um, so let's pick menus, for example. There's a link to the original video, so you can go and watch that on YouTube. Then there's a link to download the text file uh, version of the source code and then of course the original Amos file which you can load into your Amos program be that you're running it on WinUAE, FSUAE or a real Amiga. Happy days. Um, one thing I did want to draw your attention to I have a disclaimer on here which says basically you're using this code at your own risk I take no responsibility for anything going wrong while you use it but to be fair you know this is pretty simple stuff so your chances of doing any real damage are slim but it's not on me if something goes wrong, okay? Uh, right, so if you choose one of these, uh, just to click on, let's do this one, we'll do menu. So if I click on a uh, text file, that downloads a text file of the source code. And if I click on the Amos file, that brings down the Amos file. So if I open up the text file, you'll see the kind of thing that I've got here. If I just bring that into view. So once again, this is, the text file version of that code, um, which is just opened up in a plain old text editor because this is a .txt file. And this is pretty much what you're going to get. Obviously the Amos file I won't open up in here because I've got nothing on my machine which will open Amos files. But you can transfer those files across to your Amiga or your Amiga environment and open them up in there. They're exactly the same as what you see in the text file. There is nothing different. I'm just providing you with the two formats. So uh, the videos are in reverse order. Uh, here, so input fields was the first video that I did. Looking back on it now, oh, it's a bit amateurish uh, when you compare it to my latest video on how to limit your mouse. And as new videos appear, I will add the source code in here for download. Just one final thing if you like what I do, I'm on kofi.com or kofi.com. So if you want to do something there, you can do just putting it out there. I do all this stuff for free because I enjoy doing it. But, you know, sometimes if you don't ask, you don't get. Uh, <laughs> that's all I can say. So there you go. Uh, yaretro.co.uk slash downloads gets you to my downloads page where you can access all those lovely free Amos files. So there you go, dead easy to get hold of. And I hope you guys and girls out there who are using Amos can use that code uh, to advance your learning, for just make use of it. Uh, pull it apart, hack it apart, do things with it, break it. It's how we learn, it's how we code. Um, I just wanted to say a big thank you to everyone who's given me feedback, both feedback here on YouTube in the comment sections, uh, people who have given me feedback and spoken to me actually at events, uh, which has been really nice, thank you. Uh, feedback on Twitter and Mastodon as well. You know, it's been really positive and I'd like to think that, you know, you guys and girls are out there using this code and actually getting back into Amos and getting back into programming on the Amiga, which is always great news. Just quickly before I go, I did want to mention a huge thank you to the website amiganews.de, a German website for all things Amiga, been really supportive of my channel and they usually announce whenever I put new Amos videos out. So uh, to the guys and girls that are running that, a big thank you. I really appreciate it. You really need to check that website out. Loads of great Amiga stuff on there. 
Um, and that's it really for this video. Thanks once again for watching. There'll be some more Amos tutorial videos coming up in the future. Uh, if you've got anything you want to mention, any feedback, please either use the contact form on my website, get hold of me on social media, or leave some comments in the comment section down below. But until next time, stay safe and keep it retro.